Hey y'all and welcome to the video and thank you guys so so much for watching if you're new here Hello, my name is Connor. I do spoiler videos. I unbox things. I do hauls and um, I do whatever you guys want me to do um, And you guys love spoiler videos. So that's what I'm doing today. We are doing the ipsy glam bag spoilers This is for the regular bag $12 a month and you guys I have just looked at these spoilers and I'm kind of impressed Pressed with the regular bag this month like I kind of want to get it <laughs> mostly because the bag is like really cute but like the sample products coming in here are actually really good um so if you guys have the $12 a month bag you guys are actually going to be kind of impressed because if I'm impressed I think you guys will be impressed so um and I also have a question for you guys I want to keep Ipsy just for the add-on purposes mostly because like the add-ons are really good for like $3 and $12. Um, so do you guys get like the same add-ons as those who have the $25 box get or is like each tier have different add-ons that you can add on? Like, like I added on this $12 add-on last month when I had the plus. Could you guys add this on too with the regular bag? Um, I'm just curious because I want to keep it but I'd rather just get the like regular bag and pay like $12 and get my add-ons if I can still get like the same choices you know what I mean like that I would for the $25 box just let me know down below because I that's I I need your help that's a serious question <laughs> but anyways and also um if you haven't entered my giveaway yet I have this giveaway going on right here very awesome stuff um Go down to the link below, go into my giveaway after this video is over. You must be subscribed to my channel. So go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Um, but anyways, yes, let's go ahead and get into the video because I'm super excited to talk about this spoiler stuff. I don't know. Anyways, let's get into the video. Okay, so I'm gonna read it right off the website. January glam bag spoilers are here. Wondering what you might get in your January glam bag? Take a peek at some of our faves below and get ready to ring in the new year and new decade. Hello, roaring 20s in style. P.S. Looking for glam bag plus spoilers? Check them out here. Blah, blah, blah. I just did them, so I don't know which video is gonna go up first, but they're here. Just search. <laughs> my videos um I'm so bossy search through my videos <sighs> speaking of searching through my videos I just filmed this eye look using the Manny Morphe palette that's what's on my eyes search through my videos it'll be up because I'm filming all of these on the same day anyways <laughs> uh, let's stay on track so glam bag spoilers ipser ipsers ipsters signed up to receive a glam bag this January might receive. So the very first item is the uh, Glow Recipe Blueberry Bounce Gentle Cleanser. This three-in-one cleanser is perfect for using in a double cleansing routine. I've been like so into cleansers lately that my skin has been like really benefiting from it. So I would love to get this. And you know what? I might actually... <laughs> subscribe to this bag because I want the actual bag which I'm going to show you in just a second um it's so pretty um and glow recipe is so so good I just got this in my boxy charm uh boxy luxe I think yeah so this is the glow recipe watermelon glow pink joy juice moisturizer anyways uh let's not talk about boxy charm while we're in an ipsy video okay hmm. I love boxy charm <laughs> okay anyways um but if this is actually really good, I would 100% go out and purchase this because, again, I've been loving cleansers and Glow Recipe is, like, really good. And Blueberry Bounce just sounds, like, amazing. So, uh, it just sounds like it would smell good. I want this. I want a full size of this. But these are just samples. Anyways, let's move on. I want to show you the bag. Here it is. It is so pretty this bag with the marble and then like the little pink zipper oh I want it um so I'm probably just gonna subscribe for the bag <laughs> so that's that <laughs> let's move on um the next one is the Luxie Beauty 560 medium fan flawless brush find out how to use this gorgeous fan brush in our complete guide to using fan brushes oh okay no description there um me and fan brushes are kind of like Mm, we have a love-hate relationship. See, I have a fan brush, but it's like really, really thin and it doesn't like pick up like any product and put it on my face. 
Um, so we'll have to see because Luxie, I love Luxie brushes. Like I really love them. So since this is a medium fan brush, maybe it'll be thicker so it'll actually pick up the product and apply it. I've been using this brush that I got from Ipsy a long time ago. This is the S. L Miss Glam SG62. I always use this to apply my highlight and it's just, it's thick and I love it. Um, so hopefully this fan brush will be really thick so it'll actually like pick up the product and throw it on your face. So, um, I have high hopes for it though because it is a Luxie brush and Luxie has not let me down yet. <laughs> but let's move on. This one I'm going to need to go over to my vault for just a second to grab it. Okay, I'm back from my vault. Okay, so this is the Ofra Cosmetics Ofra X Nikki Tutorials Glow Goals Highlighter. Um, you can apply this peachy gold highlighter in, anywhere you want a glowy boost. So it's a peachy gold. It's not going to work for my skin tone, um, but I can show you that this is the size that you're going to get. Um, this is the one that I got in a mystery box, mystery bag. Um, it's very pretty. Their highlighters are like really freaking good. So if you get this, you're going to be like excited if it's like, you know, for your skin tone. If you're like pale like me, it'll like leave a dark cast so it won't look good. Um, but it could be used as eyeshadow too. Um, but you guys, even though this is going to be a sample size, when it comes to highlighters, these things last for a really good long time. So if you get this, I would consider it almost even a full size um, because it will last you a very long time. Um, especially if you use multiple highlighters, it's going to take a long time to go through a highlighter. Um, unless you're like a glow whore like me, maybe not, but no, seriously, it's going to last a long time. And this is actually a good size for a highlighter. Um, you really don't need like huge highlighters, but you know, I love a huge highlighter, but this is going to be fine. We're going to move on because we're, we're done talking about highlighters. <laughs> um, the next one is the Too Faced Hangover Replenishing Face Primer. This primer is amazing for hipsters with dry skin or anyone who needs some past or no post party replenishing. I can't read. Uh, anyways, um, I have tried their setting spray, um, the Too Faced Hangover setting spray, and I remember I didn't like it. I got it in a glam bag as like a little sample, and I remember I didn't like it. This, I don't know if I would like it or not, um, but I mean like they're completely two different products in the same line, so obviously you're gonna have to see for yourself if you're gonna like it, um, which is kind of crazy. You're probably like, oh my god, Connor, you don't like a Too Faced product? <laughs> but you know, whatever. But uh, yeah, I cannot say if I like this or not, but if I get it, I'm gonna try it. And uh, yeah, that's all I have to say. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I know these samples are actually really small too. So that's kind of like a bummer, but um, you can get maybe a few uses out of it. Um, the next one is the Nomad Cosmetics Nomad X Marrakesh. Uh, Medina Intense Eyeshadow in Desert Sands. Swipe this gold shade all over your eyelids for an instant bronze glow. Nomad shadows are like really good. I have one Nomad palette and I absolutely love it. I got it on Ipsy Plus and I love their shadows and this is going to be a very pretty shadow. You could probably wear this just all over your lid as one shade, which is something that I used to do all the time. I used to just wear one shadow all over my lid and I was good to go because I didn't know nothing about eyeshadow. Um, I still really don't, but I started playing this year and I think I've gotten a little bit better. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is one of the spoilers. And then the last spoiler is actually kind of crazy. Um, so I'm not sure if this is going to be a full size product. By the looks of it, it's looking like a full size product, but we won't really know until we get it um, if it's a full size. But this is the Morphe Fluidity Full Coverage Concealer in shades 1.25, 1.55, 2.25, 3.35, 4.5, 5.5, 6.5, 7.5, 8.5, 9.5, 10.5, 11.5, 12.5, 13.5, 14.5, 15.5, 16.5, 17.5, 18.5, 19.5, 20.5, 21.5, 22.5, 23.5, 24.5, 25.5, 26.5, 27.5, 28.5, 29.5, 30.5, 31.5, 32.5, 33.5, 34.5, 35.5, 36.5, 37.5, 38.5, 39.5, 40.5, 41.5, 42.5, 43.5, 44.5, 45.5, 46.5, 47.5, 48.5, 49.5, 50.5, 51.5, 52.5, 53.5, 54.5, 55.5, 56.5, 57.5, 58.5, 59.5, 60.5, 61.5, 62.5, 63.5, 64.5, 65.5, 66.5, 67.5, 68.5, 69.5, 70.5, 71.5, 72.5, 73.5, 74.5, 75.5, 76.5, 77.5, 78.5, 79.5, 80.5, 81.5, 82.5, 83.5, 84.5, 85.5, 86.5, 87.5, 88.5, 89.5, 90.5, 91.5, 92.5, 93.5, 94.5, 95.5, 96.5, 97.5, 98.5, 99.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 100.5, 
concealer. It's so good. And then months and months, like six months, eight months later, she filmed a video where she was using the concealer and she was like, I know it took me a long time to get behind this, but I finally really like it. And people were like calling her out for that. Um, so I don't know if this is going to be a good concealer, but I'm wondering if they are trying to like put a concealer out because, um, BoxyCharm is doing the concealer thing now and like foundation thing, which I know they're doing the um, concealer next month for uh, the Pretty Vulgar. Um, so I don't know. Maybe they're trying to compete again with BoxyCharm, but every time they compete with BoxyCharm, they kind of just go downhill. Um, but hopefully you guys will get some shades that will actually match your skin tone. That's kind of like the big thing is matching your skin tone. Um, hopefully if I got this, the lightest shade would match me. I'm very pale. Like this is the porcelain shade of the Too Faced Born This Way and it's still too dark for me. Um, so if that tells you anything. Um, but I think it's pretty cool that they're adding a concealer. So I hope that it does work for you. You get the shade that you can actually use. And um, yeah, you know what? Thumbs up for Ipsy to try and be a little more, you know, cool by adding a concealer to like block the haters and all them baggage baggages to the hater, all the haters baggages. The bag, I, you know, I try to be funny, but I'm not funny. So we're gonna end the spoiler video here. <laughs> But yeah, that is it for today's video. Let me know in the comments down below how you are feeling about the $12 bag. Do you think it's worth the $12 so far with these products? I think it actually is. The bag itself is so cute. But let me know down below your thoughts on Ipsy so far and all of that. And uh, yeah, so don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. It would mean the absolute world to me. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.